Hey, thank you all so very much. I want to take the opportunity first to introduce myself. My name is uh, Jack Connor, Madeline Connor's dad. My daddy used to always say when I was coming up, he said, if you want time to fly by, if they got a short term note to bank, or set a wedding day, he was right. There. It seems like just yesterday this young man came to my house on a Sunday afternoon and asked me if he could marry my daughter. He said, WC, first question is, do you love your son? He said, yes, sir, I do. I love him. So good, I believe. But the one that gets it is, baby, if you and your daddy will take a walk tomorrow. At the end of the walk that you're going to take me tomorrow, your mother and I feel the man that God intended you to marry is going to be waiting for you. We love you both. Thank you all for being here tonight and celebrating these two outstanding young folks. And I hope everyone has a great time. Thank you. As far as Statesboro love stories go, y'all make the list when it comes to the the, to the romance category, I gotta say, WC, you knocked it out of the park. That first date to Zaxby's. <clears throat> I, I mean, we're laughing, but we're here, dude. I mean, you got it done. Sailed the deal. And here you are. Beautiful, in love, surrounded by family. On a day that, that is the continuation of this love story. It feels like it's There's, there's something about love that turns the world on its head. There's something about love that, that you can't do too much of it. And you stand in front of us as examples of that. The, the, the world needs more of what you found and you so abundantly, extravagantly give away. Well done. as Madeline and WC have consented together in holy wedlock, I pronounce that they are husband and wife together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. And now WC, you may kiss the bride. It's my great privilege to present to you Mr. and Mrs. WC Hodges IV. Oh man. I think about those feet now on the cracker, cranking Sunny D on the back of my pickup. And uh, now he's uh, eating Skittles and drinking Mountain Dew, you know? We love Madeline to death. We can't wait till they come in, you know, tomorrow. She'll come in our family. Apparently, she's already been in their family a lot. Jennifer feeds him all the time, but I've been told we uh, we just so excited and uh, we want to toast y'all. It really is an honor to stand by you uh, during one of the sweetest weekends of your life. I admire you more than you will ever know. You're confident, smart, beautiful, passionate about your work, 
and you really make those around you feel loved and warm. It's been very special over the years to watch WC not just love and cherish those things about you, but cherish you and what makes you special. And I really do wish that for you forever and wish you both a lifetime of happiness together. And I love you guys. At most weddings I've been to, people talk about meeting the groom. But a memory that stands out even more in my mind is the first time I ever heard you two talk on the phone together. And I thought to myself, man, she has found somebody just as quirky as her. Never stop having that kind of fun. The strongest examples of marriage that I have in my life all share in this principle. I really can't explain what the two of you mean to me and how excited I am to watch you hold a life together. Please raise your glasses and let's have a toast to Madeline and WC. I love you too so, so much.